here. Can you hang on down into turn one as we have a white flag. One lap to go. I think Maxwell in that Ford Mustang is the fastest car on the racetrack, but he's just run out of time here. Ooh, Papelli's going to look to the inside. Woo! Hey, and Boosh covers it. It's almost his boss. Wide. wide. He's going to struggle there. He's just got to slow it way down. Connor Bloom goes through as well. He nearly got into the back of Eric Foss. That was awfully close. Pompelli had a run on him. LaFouche just tried to take it a little bit deeper and just touched the rear end of Eric Foss. And Owen Trinkler did that drive through. Then that caution came out. Owen Trinkler is right now up into the uh, fifth spot with LaFouche running wide. That was a great comeback. Awesome Again, recovery. Felt, yeah, I mean, obviously helped huge by that caution flag. But boy, I'll tell you, Trent Hinman continues to prove every time we watch him, Cal, he's got a special level of talent, doesn't he? Oh, he really does. He won this championship a couple of years ago, co-driving with John Edwards, BMW factory pilot, and BMW got their eye on him, took him over to Europe, gave him some time, and ultimately, at the end of 2015, decided to let him go. And I think that was a huge mistake because the boy has yep. tremendous talent. Obviously, there's a limit on the amount of the seats that they can provide for these young stars, but... He is one who's definitely slipped through their net a little bit. Well, they had three wins last year, and he's got to just get through Speedway 3 and 4, but the two-car battle behind him, the C.J. Wilson Racing team cars, filling out the podium at this stage, but Faulkner gets a little bit of a run on Miller. It'll be close. Gonna pop him at the line, possibly. Up front, though, is Hinman. Hinman coming into the tri-oval. It's not only a Porsche win at Daytona, a Porsche one, two, three, and make it a four as well. But Maxwell able to get up into fifth. But what a day for Body Motion Racing and NST Mini. What a story. And Matt Pombo brings the number 73 Mini JCW through the trioval. And Mini wins at Daytona to kick off the season. Eric Foss just hanging on over Pompelli to complete the podium in ST. What a fabulous race in both classes. That was just awesome stuff. We had so many resets, so much strategy going on, penalties, and we had it all here. I mean, this four-hour endurance race, <laughs> it was a hit. It really was. That was a great opening round to this championship season. And how about this for Mini J 